Yo, what is up, bros? Back with another 1943 challenge conquest. Going for the next achievement as far as beating it with what is this? 12? 12 nations is the next step to the achievement, which we're going to be doing with the ROC. All right, bros, plan is obviously drop any general that has any economic ability, but we're going to be dropping all our elite artillery on the Japanese front. We're going to be throwing down a bunch of crap or tank generals since they very rarely get used anyways on all these Shermans. Let them go at the Japanese. We'll send out um, our infantry to Africa if they need to go. I don't even know if we'll need to go. Like it's Africa's pretty random. Like sometimes it's completely cleared when you get there and other times it's like I wouldn't say the Axis are winning, but it's kind of like a stalemate. And of course, we'll send our elite tank units out of northern China for the European up front. That is the plan. Bros, real quick though, before we get too far into this, I got to give a shout out. Boom to the member bros, especially those tier three field marshals. Golden Boy 6198, Sugar Bear 2020 YT, and Beast of East 9817. Along with all you other colonels and privates, thank you for supporting the channel. So one other thing is I got a big upgrade coming for the combat medic. Um, I that actually I'm gonna I'm gonna make a short of it because it's it's it goes from 60 healing to 120. That's big enough for a short, right? And I might actually get that out before this video goes out. So. It might be in reverse order of the way I'm talking. Anyways, I also got a an, another elite unit that is uh, ready for an upgrade as well. And it does affect it upgrades the uh, perk. It is the priest. And I'll make a short on that. Right off hand, I don't remember because it just happened. I just got the cards for it. I don't remember uh, the perk it upgrades. More critical strike damage or chance? I don't, I don't even remember. It's nice they start you out with a Chenault. Uh, so you can get the uh, Japanese generals from counterattacking. While, you, while you're still stuck with crapper generals to go up against them. Of course, Limpy's going to lead the way. Limpy's going to lead the way from the rear. Man, it feels weird having generals on Shermans. That is just abnormal. It doesn't feel right. So I would also like to get our naval generals down, but I don't know if we'll be able to. So I'm going to save them for pretty much last, and by that time, we'll probably have Japan pretty much out of it anyways. Oh, look who it is. Did you see Abrams roll up on Kluga? 1939 Kluga would be so disappointed in 43 Kluga. So disappointed. And we get get some double combat medics, you know, we shouldn't We shouldn't lose too many bros. Although if we put any near the coast Probably going to get wrecked. Probably send the crapper generals on the Shermans. They can go handle the coastal areas. Economy's still kind of crap. Need to, need to grab a few more cities. We're not even making a thousand around yet. You bros have, have better step it up. Over my shoulder, bros. If you have not noticed, is my new PC. Brand spanking new. Well, I, not exactly brand spanking new, but because it was an open box. I don't know what video I, I spoke about my new PC in, but a lot of you may not have uh, heard me talking about it. I saved a thousand dollars 
on this PC. Because it was open box. I think either somebody either somebody had bought it and had it for almost like one day before you had to return it because it had quite a bit of dust on the fan or that or um, it was a floor model. So I don't know. It came with the original factory warranty and plus, you know, when that gets close to running, I'll just add the other warranty if I'm having any problems with it. But I bought my last PC was remanufactured. Never had a problem with it. Spent like $160. Boom! Thailand goes down $160 on the extended warranty for it because I was just like, hey, if I'm going to buy an electronic that's remanufactured, I want an extended warranty. Never used it. Never had a problem with it. I mean, I... And of course, I'm, I'm searching Reddit and stuff, and there's some horror stories, but I've never had a problem. Um... So hopefully I won't have a problem with a uh, open box one. A thousand was just too good to pass up it. I got it from Best Buy, a Best Buy in another state actually, because um, I guess with open boxes, they don't ship them. Even to a different store closer to you, they won't. So I had to drive, what was the drive? Oh, how long was that drive? Was it four or six hours? One way. Anyways, yeah. It was totally worth it. Save that much money. But maybe I'll do a, I'll do a maybe a members only video showing it off. Like I I think I did my last PC I did that with too. Alright, well, I'm going to be honest with you guys about our progress so far. I thought we'd be further along, but, um, you know, whatever. These bros in the south. Koniv, you have a title now. Like, act like it. Act like you have a magnificent title. So, when I was upgrading... Okay, remember when I played at 39 Germany and I was just like, oh shit, this is hard. And then I put um, rumor back on some of my top tank generals. And then I found out obviously that you really only need rumor on your top tank generals for Germany. And then I figured out, well, actually with Chanel, you don't even really need that. But anyways, I'm just now getting um, well, I had to I had to rob from a couple crappier generals. Reset a couple perks down to one to get enough medals to do what I wanted to do. I'm finally getting boom hungry goes down. I'm finally getting everybody's perks back to where they were. I'm, I'm gonna try to land a few bros in Japan. Why not? Yeah, our, um, we just lost, we just lost our air bro. Boom, Romania goes down. We lost our freaking air bro. That's the bro who always handles the Japanese front. It had to be Yamamoto. Well, I guess there's another aircraft carrier bro as well. Yeah, they probably double teamed him. And poor Spats. Poor me. Now I'm going to take on AA. For the rest of the time. I think those are the only two bros I'm going to send to Europe and they can capture city. We'll drop the rest of the bros once we're there. I mean, look at that. Where is Spats when you need him? Under a ton of rubble. Because he got annihilated. Well, that was, that was easy enough. Shit. So I've been getting people asking about the next uh, update. I don't know anything about it yet. I haven't seen anything. 
Uh, nobody's contacted me or get, gave me any little hints. So, you know, obviously it's probably going to be on the next conquest. But as far as maybe other generals or, you know, elite units, don't know anything. Damn, they took every port. Can we? You know what? I mean, I haven't been paying too close attention to what's been going on, but we lost a kind of a crapload of generals. I mean, they were on crapper Shermans, and I did have, you know, good generals on by the coast or on cities with double aircraft carriers. So it's not a shock that we lost some bros, but we lost a decent amount. So guys, I guess um, I'm going to have to play with another Axis country here soon. Means another incoming 40 minute video. Who do I got to play with left? Romania. Hungary, Bulgaria, Finland. Oh, I can play with Finland. Yeah, Finland might be all right. Yeah, I might play with Finland next. Yeah, Finland it is. Finland's on the schedule up next. I was going to play with, uh, speaking of Finland, um, I was going to play with Cuba, right? Or Mexico, but I realized I had just done Brazil. And it was kind of going to be uh, a similar attack. So I was just like, I, can't, I don't want to do two similar attacks back to back. Uh, yeah, we'll just throw down some ROC, then throw down some Finland, and probably do Canada, not Canada, Cuba or Mexico. Boom! Bulgaria goes down. Nice little, um... Nice little Berlin capture with Guderian holding it down. I've been pretty lucky with our Berlin captures. So hopefully we can get down a, a couple naval units. I kind of want a little revenge. We don't have to go crazy on the revenge, but I would like to get a little bit of revenge. They made my journey a lot harder than it should have been by knocking out spats. I mean, look at we've lost. Uh, there's there's a couple gray portraits there, huh? The Godforsaken Bloodbath. In fact, this is probably the most generals I've lost. I mean, I obviously... With the four knowledge of knowing that I'm not going to lose. Here I played reckless and loose with my generals. If I had to, I would, uh, you know, if I had to, all my generals would always survive. See what's... Bruh. The Axis should not be that great in Africa at this point. They got far too many units. Italy had, what, three cities? What the hell is going on, guys? Got British bros surrounded by the entire Africa Corps, including a mouse tank, a Gustav, and a damn tiger. Alpinis, man. I can't wait till I have Alpinis that are that high a level that they can make everybody go stupid. But of course, when I have an Alpine, it probably won't make anybody go stupid. I'll get ripped off. I'll get some, some ghetto Dollar General Alpine. Boom! Japan! Allies! 
I didn't even get to foolish, fully punish the Japanese Navy. But I'll take it. What the hell? There you go, Munstein. Munstein awakens. Hopefully get an early start on some of these docks, so it's not the last thing we have to do. Obviously, guys. You knew that was coming. The Swiss with behind this whole war. As they always are. If there's a war going on somewhere, think of how the Swiss benefit. Russia, Ukraine, somewhere in there, Swiss. Middle East, Swiss somewhere. All the shit going on, off and on all the time in Africa. You guessed it, the Swiss. Boom! Put an end to the Swiss. No more meddling. Alright, that'll speed it up a little bit. I guess we had a slow start, but this definitely sped up for seeing. Uh, not gonna have enough. Boom! Italy goes down. Shit! My allies have taken Japan and Italy out. Shocking. Allies are throwing it down. All right, Rose, the end is near. I mean, yeah, I guess missile technologies is far superior. The one thing I screwed up on, I should have started moving a air general through this front. Save me a little bit of money. Could have been doubting. I didn't need anything great. You know, give me doubting. Hey, doubting? Hey! You can't tuck shit on doubting. I mean, for a... Boom! Germany goes down. For a general that you purchase with just metals and it's not... Totally insane amount. He's pretty good. There it is. 12 of 12. Up next, 16. Bros, if you're enjoying this content, you know what to do. Stop, subscribe, hit the notification bell, so back your products upload. Peace. Broominati out.